What's up Laravel developers, it's Dari here and today I want to quickly show you how we could fix the Laravel Mix NPM run dev error when you try to pull in frameworks. During my Laravel 8 blog video and complete tutorial I've run into some Laravel Mix issues and it's pretty difficult to find the right solution on the internet. A lot of people said that I should make a separate video on how to solve this issue and here it is. Before I show you the solution I want to quickly show you the error that we're running into. So I have a folder on my desktop called Workspace where I store my Laravel projects. I've also created a custom command called cdw where I could easily change directories into my workspace. So let's hit enter and as you can see we're right in our workspace. Now the next step is to create a new project. So let's say Laravel new test project. Hit enter and as you can see it's creating a new project and this might take a couple seconds. All right, it's almost done. Laravel has hit us with an application ready, build something amazing message. But that's pretty difficult when you run into an error of Laravel mix. Now the first thing that we need to do is to go inside our Laravel project. So let's say CD test project. Then we need to pull in Laravel's UI. So let's say composer require Laravel forward slash UI. Hit enter. And for this example, I want to pull in Tailwind and React. Now, in order to pull in Tailwind, we need to we need to run Composer require Laravel dash frontend dash presets forward slash Tailwind CSS space double dash dev. Let's hit enter, and it's already done. Now we're ready to pull in Tailwind. So let's say PHP artisan UI Tailwind. That's a typo, tailwind css, space, double dash, odd. By running this command, Laravel will automatically discover the tailwind package. So let's hit enter. Now before we run npm install and npm run dev, let's pull in react as well. So let's say php artisan ui react. All right, the react scaffolding has been installed as well. Now let's run npm install, double ampersand, npm run dev. This might take a second, so hold on and I'll show you the error message that we're getting. All right, here it is. This is the error that we're looking for. Laravel mix npm error has been failed since it's a development script. A lot of people that reach out to me get stuck right here. So let me show you the solution. The first thing that we need to do is to remove Laravel mix. So let's say npm remove Laravel dash mix. Hit enter. And this might take a second because it's a pretty big file. All right, zero vulnerabilities have been found. Now what we need to do next is to install Laravel Mix in save dev. So let's run npm install Laravel dash mix space double dash save dash dev. Let's hit enter. All right, now we need to install npm cross env and save dev as well. So let's say npm install cross dash env space double dash save dash dev. Hit enter. And this might take a second as well. So pause it again. All right. And right now we need to perform our last command, which is npm install double ampersand npm run dev. Hit enter. Now, as you can see, our app.js and app.css got compiled. Let me show it to you. Let me open a new tab or page. Let's open Visual Studio Code. And let me open my workspace. Now let's drag test project into Visual Studio Code. Let's make it bigger. And let me close off the messages. Now inside my public directory, I have a CSS folder and a app.css inside of it. Let's open it. And as you can see, our Tailwind has been compiled. And to double check it, we could open resources, CSS, app.css, and we have imported three Tailwind files, a base, component, and utilities. All right, this was it for this video. If you do like these types of videos where I fix issues, let me know in the comment section down below. If you do like my content and you want to see more, leave this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to this channel, please hit the subscribe button.